Hey, this is Janice and her daughter Nora. Janice Bowers. Yes, silly girl. And Janice is the author of a cookbook uh, called The Dinner Spin, and she also has a website. And basically, you're all about keeping it easy, keeping it healthy for your family, right. get, getting dinner on the table. You know? Exactly. There's three keys. Yep, it's got to be easy, healthy, and delicious. Um, if you don't have all three of those, it's not worth cooking. So Absolutely. I mean, if you go too healthy, and then they might not eat it. You right. know what I mean? So it's, yep. you really have to get a balance Like that there. balance. Yeah, and that's so. what the dinner spin is all about. So um, We're making a kind of a pizza casserole, right? Right. Yep. And this, again, just like the peanut and pretzel tenders, it's totally subject to your taste and your interpretation. Um, so we like to load up. This is uh, ground sirloin. Okay. So it's very lean, 95% lean. A little salt and pepper. Uh, yep. Get it salted there, and then we'll Nora. just add in a little garlic. My fabulous helper can is going to put that in there. Just kind yeah. of dump it in. In the dump. There you yep. go. We're going to use this, and then um, onions and and or excuse me, yep. red, red and green, and green pepper. peppers. Yep, whatever you've got. Shredded you carrots, um, zucchini. This there time of year, go. if you're looking for a way to add in some of your um, garden Good vegetables, girl. right in there. Oop, you go ahead. <laughs> You're doing it. You're doing yeah. great. There you go. Perfect. Very okay, so we good. just want to let those veggies get a little bit soft, right? Yep. We'll get okay. them soft because they will bake up. Um, we actually add uh, to kind of make the sauce. We can get this all going in, at Nora? once. Okay, so you we've got diced tomatoes. Diced tomatoes. Dump yep. Right this in. is like good a basil um, and oregano already in it. Great so tip and trick. Get the you know get yep, the tomatoes. Got a little bit of flavor cost anymore. Get yep. the ones that have you know a little flavor. Yeah. Yep. And then just some no salt added tomato sauce to add um, to the sauce without adding a lot of sodium. Because those jarred uh, spaghetti sauces or marinara sauces can be pretty salty. Okay. So, so that's it, that. That's, so that's that. that easy. Get that going. Doesn't that smell good? Nice. Doesn't it smell good? Do you like pizza? I think that you're really going to love pizza. Uh, I know, most kids do. I know my kids, my son Riley, really likes yep. pizza. If he could have it for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, he would. Yep. So this goes in the bottom of a casserole dish? Yep. Should we spray it? Do we need to spray it? Um, mm. Yeah, we can mm. give it a spray. That'll save some time in yes. the cleanup. Yep, exactly. All right. And then this goes just right down over the bottom? Over the bottom. And then instead, whoo! There we go. That's the fun part too. We fight over opening those cans. Yeah. In the house. Did it pop? Did it make a big pop? Big so explosion. these are just biscuits. So just biscuits. Um, your favorite variety. You okay. can get the generic brand and save a few bucks. Or if you really like the Pillsbury, those are definitely the best. Cheese over the top? Or yep. We'll okay. sprinkle the cheese over the top. Does it go the, over the biscuits, or does it go over the this? Uh, um, over the yeah, we'll put okay. it over the the mixture here. Okay, you can so, do that, sweetie. And just I'm just gonna actually good just kind of we'll just spread it out. And this is shredded like an Italian blend cheese. Yep. That again, give some extra flavor in there without Ooh, adding how's a lot. That cheese there, Nora. <laughs> that's the, <laughs> that's fun, the part. fun part. Exactly. Is the taste right. testing. I'll so. never forget my daughter was a uh, we were I was sauteing portobello mushrooms spring. and she was. Huh? You can start sprinkling some oh, of those on These top. are just biscuits that we're cutting up into fours, yep. and they just get plopped all around. There yep. you go, Nora. But I was sauteing <laughs> um, portobello mushrooms, and she came running downstairs. She was about three or four years old. She said, oh my gosh, what in the world are you making? It smells amazing. And she proceeded to eat the entire pan of sauteed oh. mushrooms. And I thought, oh, that, that's it. I mean, what little girl eats mushrooms? But she smelled them. She'd been in the kitchen with me. And, yep. you know, that's a great way to get them to eat different things. Yep. You're Nor doing so Nora great. and I like mushrooms, and we're trying to trick Daddy and Coley into liking them, don't we? <laughs> One day you will. You will, I promise. So yeah. sprinkle that. Anything on top or just go in just um, as, as is? Yeah, if you want to, you can put, um, if you've got fresh herbs from your garden, like a little bit of that pesto that Ireland was making, you could sprinkle on top. But yeah, for today, we can just uh, set it in there. And here it is. This bakes. Uh, what is the oven temperature? 400. And look at this. It bubbles right up, those biscuits. Nora, does that look good? Yeah. That pizza casserole, well, anything yummy, pizza and kids yummy. Are gonna eat it, Thank you so. guys so much. The dinnerspin.com, dinnerspin.com, and Amazon.com for the cookbook. Wonderful. Thanks, ladies. Thanks, Nora. It was a pleasure to meet you. We'll be back. <laughs>